May God forgive me for what I'm about to do. I also pray that you, Martha, will forgive me. No! We don't do this! We do not do this! No! No! Welcome back to the MGN channel. I'm your host, Cornish. I've missed everyone here, so we're going to be doing a lot more content. I'm back, and we're going to be discussing the... No, 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 no. We're going to... Like, first time I come back, and we're going to have to talk about a game called Martha is Dead. Martha is Dead is a dark, photorealistic, first-person psychological thriller Set in the 1944 in Italy, you play as Julia, a twin sister of Martha who also discovers the body of her twin sister, then steals her identity to try and find out who killed Martha. As you progress through the game and the story, there is a lot of tales and twists with the Lady of the Lake and other stories telling the game whilst being the daughter of a German general in World War II. Yeah, you, you know what? German, woman... It's just, nah, nah. Although this is a heavy storytelling, it is one of the most disturbing games I've ever played in my entire life. I'm, I'm not gonna throw out anything. It is literally an insane, messed up game. Oh no! What am I doing? What am I doing? Jesus Christ. That is a... There is so much wrong with this game. I can I can now understand why PlayStation was kicking off at this game and wanted this game banned. Oh my god. Like this makes Harvester child friendly. It's oh god. It's just hell, just cutting a dead body and then cutting out a fetus. What is that? Peeling someone's face off. How the hell does someone come up with this? Oh, okay. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. I'm, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. So let's talk about the gameplay. It's a semi-open world from the house to the woods and then to the lake. You'll find a lot of story paths that will lead you to the end, as well as a lot of side quests and plot in the Martha is Dead story. Julia, who loves to f photo stuff, and with that you have an old-fashioned camera that is being played as a big role in the game. With upgrades and taking the perfect picture, you can find clues of other ghostly things around the game. With items to find and using tarot cards, there are many things to do in the game. The narrating story telling you by Julia is very disturbing and horrifying. The fact that when I was hearing the entire story from here to the end, I had such a sour taste. Honestly, it was it was something. But with that being said, uh, I'm gonna I want to throw up the puzzles. The puzzles are pretty unique and pretty hardish. I am terrible at Morse code puzzle games. Anyone who's seen me live or do any video that has a Morse code puzzles will know I struggled on it. And with Martha is Dead, I struggled on that for quite some time. Um, there are also some other unique cool little puzzles. Uh, and just kind of like a fetch thing as well. Um, from the German soldiers, depending on what choice you make. Uh, from just like getting the photo of the right angle and then taking it back and getting it developed. There's even a bit on the game where you have to find a bike pump. Now, you get a bike outside and I searched everywhere for a bike pump only to find it was on another bike in the front door of the patio thing. And that was pretty annoying. But, you know, small puzzles, fetch puzzles and also Morse code puzzles is something that is quite annoying on this game. But... You know, I managed to go for it. But with, with that being said, the visuals is really good. Um, as it's a photorealistic, they went full hard on this. They really did. Um, from the from the beautiful views of the Italy and like the woods area to the face face peeling. God, why? Just why? To the to the rotten corpse with mag infested whilst delivering a baby to no no 
No, I don't want to think about it. Oh, God. No. To the, to the cutting open your dead sister, finding a deformed... I really don't like talking about this. I, for my first video back to do a review, and I ha at like, and I'm doing Arthur is dead. Honestly, the game has is really disgusting. Visual wise, it's disgustingly beautiful. May God forgive me for what I'm about to do. I also pray that you, Martha, will forgive me. No, we don't do this. We do not do this. I think we're done tonight, guys. That, what the f That was two heads and a baby! Martha was pregnant. I'm, um, I can't do this. This is done. This is done. You can't do this anymore. Is this even allowed on Twitch? In overall, it's one of the messed up games I've ever played, but it's a dark storytelling, and you've got to fig like remember it's a dark storytelling, and there's going to be some disturbing scenes. The fact that they um, they put a suicide helpline, a safeinourworld.org, I will put that link in the description, uh, just for anyone who is suffering from mental issues or suicide thoughts, etc., etc. Like the the fact that because this game has that, there is a lot of self harm. There's a lot of disturbing images, some horrible, horrible scenes, and uh, enough to make you all messed up. If I was to play this game, it would be life or death. And the fact that um, if someone put a gun to my head, I would play it. That's fair enough. Anyone would. But if someone, if I was over a friend and they were like, oh yeah, I got Martha's dead. you fancy playing that? Hell no. Nope. Nope. Uh, to anyone who has a sick mind, in, go and get it check it out um a lot of controversy was with this game yet the ratings is really good and it's and it's and it should do as it's a very heavy dark storytelling i won't spoil anything you guys be the judge you can go and check it out the links are in the description of the game on steam uh, i would recommend playing it on pc as the playstation has censored most of all the stuff uh pretty much majority of it so there you go well, that's my review. I do hope you enjoyed this video. Hit the subscribe button. Help the MGN.GG grow or MGN.TV YouTube. Uh, it would help us a huge if you'd stay in support. Have a laugh. If you want to see any more reviews and any other uh, articles, we do have a website called MGN.GG. So don't forget to check that out. And that is Cornish signing out. You guys take care and have a wonderful night.